Okay, hello everyone. Welcome to She Boss Talk. I am your host, Shante Arati, and we are so excited to be here. This is our 2020 season, right? So we're excited about all the things that are going to be happening with our show. And one of the great things that we're doing uh, in this season, right, is we're doing, we're going to be doing some series. And the first series that we're doing is talking about the significance of this decade that we're in for women in business because there's just something special about this decade there's just things that women are going to be doing in this decade and so this gives us the opportunity to talk with women about what they think is significant in this decade and how they're going to show up with significance in this decade so please do tune in, share with other uh, phenomenal she bosses out there. Uh, you can expect to tune in to us every Thursday uh, where we're live and you can view episodes every Friday on YouTube, right? And you can also find us on IGTV. So with that said, we want to get right to it. We have a special guest with us. Her name is Michelle Druitt, okay? So she's one of the phenomenal she bosses that we want to talk to. So Michelle, hi. How are you today? Hi, how are you? I'm so How's it good. going? It's good. I, I've been busy. What about yourself? Yes, me too. I've been extremely busy. Yes. So tell our audience, give them a little insight uh, into who Michelle is and what you do. Okay. Um. You already know my name, Michelle Druitt. I am a parent advocate for autistics and the caregivers of, you know, and families of autistic people. I am also an ambassador for Cherish and the Now We Know campaign. So basically what I do is I advocate for autistic people and I also go from school to school, churches, women's organizations. And we talk about the feminine hygiene industry, what's out there, what we should be using, what we shouldn't use, and just like girl talk awesome and i want to mention that michelle is also one of the ambassadors of she boss talk right yes um, she's been a phenomenal uh, ambassador a phenomenal supporter uh of our show um and we're very appreciative uh of you for that okay so let's talk about the significance so you talked about and i love the work that you're doing uh your advocacy mm -hmm. and your work i mean you have a close relationship um with um autism right because you yes. have an autistic son right yes yes ma'am i do yes my youngest okay. son is autistic yes right so you're doing great work out here in in that regard and um and also for women as far as health like i'm i'm such an advocate for women's wellness right health and Absolutely. wellness and the fact that you're doing that is fantastic so I wanted just to start with actually what you do and what do you feel the significance, right, that you play in the role um, that you're in for what you're doing? What, okay. is, what is the significance of your role in advocacy okay. for autism and or, right, helping women in their wellness? Yes. First of all, let me just really briefly say that she boss talk that platform is absolutely phenomenal it's just amazing i want to thank you for creating it and and allowing me to be a part of it and she boss talk actually is playing a significant role in what i'm doing because like i said the platform is phenomenal it is giving me the opportunity to share information basically that's what advocacy is it's help it's exchange it's exchanging ideas resources um talk we talk about programming uh one of the reasons why i got involved with the now we know campaign was because i'm an advocate the product cherish is phenomenal and when i first heard about it i said hmm this is something that sounds like it would be very good for women on the spectrum that have sensory issues because when we're talking about our feminine health and wellness information is the key and that's another reason why um I got into this. You know, people say knowledge is power, knowledge is power. I agree somewhat, but knowledge is only powerful if you do something with it. If you put it to action. You gotta put it to action. That yes. action has got to be there. You gotta show up and show out. You gotta put in the work. Yes, absolutely. 
Okay, so when you think of the significance of women of this decade for women, what does that mean to you? What do you think the significance is and how we show up as women in this decade? Um, it's, it, you know what, the whole thing, the 2020 thing, we've been building up. We have actually been building up. And women in business have exploded beyond anything a lot of us would have imagined. And again, it's because we have all of these phenomenal platforms. She Boss Talk is one of them. You know, the significance of women in business would not be as significant if we weren't given a voice. We need to be given a voice. We need to be heard. We need to be able to have some place to showcase. And I think the significance of us being in business is because of platforms like She Boss Talk. There are quite a few platforms that are cropping up, that are coming up, that are giving women an opportunity to speak and giving us the chance to share what we're doing with other women and encourage them to say, you know what, listen, if I could do it, you can do it. So the significance, the real significance of women in businesses in this decade is for us to reach out to our sisters, give them a hand, say, you know what, come on, look, look what I did in 2018. Look what I did in 2019. Now 2020 is your turn. That's right. I, I so agree with you um, because that's why we have this platform to, to allow women to not only use, use their voices, but amplify their voices, right? Um, yeah. Because it really kind of boils down to power. Women are powerful and we, we need women to show up in their power around the world because yeah. we are here to make a significant impact. Um, right. We're needed in the world, right? And so we need uh, and we deserve for the world to hear us, to hear what we have to say, to hear, to know what we have to offer to the world because we are such gifted individuals and hardworking yes. individuals and we're leading in entrepreneurship, Yes, we are. Right? Yes, we are. yes that's, signi that's significant too. That's when significant. I read that last year, I said, uh-oh, 2020 is going to be the year that we explode because like you said there are so many phenomenal women out there and we are doing some fantastic things i mean we're inventing stuff we're reinventing ourselves we're you know uh, uh just take for example i was just talking to somebody about this whole thing with um target and the honey pot now when i go out even though i represent a sanitary pad I always mention Honeypot because it's a it's a woman owned business. I followed her when I got started because I was looking at her and what she was doing. I read up on Honeypot. We now have so many significant women in in roles that we weren't in years ago. There are so many CEOs. You know, there are listen, we 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 we're getting it in this year. And so with that being said, there really is no reason, no excuse what, when you say, you know, I can't. We're going to take that out of our vocabulary. We are going to replace that with I'm going to mm -hmm. or when I do it. There's not no more can't. There's not any more if. Yes. We, we, listen, we've arrived. We've arrived. Yes, we have. Yes. And I like how you're talking about, um, you know, your advocacy and what you're doing and how that doesn't create a um competition for other women like you you can support other women and what they're doing and their achievements Absolutely. and making sure that they win and i i personally think that that is significant that is another thing that makes this decade significant because i think that in order for us to really amplify our influence and our impact that we we have to come together. So we have Absolutely. to be, have a collaborative mindset. So I just wanted Absolutely. to get your um, viewpoint on how mm -hmm. significant you believe collaboration is for women in this decade. Oh, oh my God. You know, it's funny you should say that because all my efforts to collaborate and to partner have actually leveled me up for example um and i forgot to mention i just got invited to be on the board of spectrum warriors which is an organization that supports the autistic community and they reached out to me they said we see what you're doing they said you're always promoting other 
businesses, promoting other women. I believe that teamwork makes the dream work. That's number one. And there's no I in team. You know, all those things that seem cliche, they, the sayings may be cliche, but let me tell you something. It actually works. It works. We don't have to do it alone because there are, again, so many amazing and so many awesome women out there. We can learn from each other and we can help each other. There is room for everyone. And just like I, you know, just like I was saying about the honeypot, I tell them, I say, you know what, as long as you're using an all natural or organic pad, then you're good. It doesn't have to be cherished. It doesn't, but as long as, because we're talking about health and wellness. And when we talk about that, you can't just be about just your business because your business should be everybody's business. I mean, we should be in the business of lending a hand of saying, okay, my sister's doing something. Let me share a post. My sister's doing something. If she can't use my product, I know someone that can use her product and vice versa. It's not going to take any shine away from you to help somebody else promote their product or to talk about their product. There are so many of us out there. there and there's room for everybody to grow. There's room for everybody to uh, 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 follow their dream, live in their passion, be, I mean, be purposeful. It is just the thing to do. I mean, because you can't do it alone. Let's face it, you can't. So, and I've partnered with some phenomenal women, graphic artists, um, people in marketing, um, especially the health and wellness field. Oh, the body bombs and the and the body butters. I'm having a good time. You know, I'm having, I, listen, sometimes it doesn't feel like business. It feels like it's fun, you know, with yeah. the networking and all that stuff, you know, and the meeting some of these amazing women. It's inspiring and empowering and uplifting. So I say to myself, listen, let me find out how she did such and such. And let me see what I can do to help her. I always say, you know what, what can I do to help you? Yes, absolutely. Like, this is so great. Okay, so I have one more question uh, for you uh, for this series. And that comes back to you. And what significant impact do you hope to achieve in this decade? I hope to change and save some lives through, you know, through the product, through the product, through Cherish. Um, like I said, it's a phenomenal product. Uh, this is a product that eliminates cramps. That's a significant change because you know what? If we're not well, how are we gonna run our business? If we don't feel good, if we got headaches, and I mean, you know, we all know as women, the anxiety and the stress and the frustration that comes with our cycle. And part of the reason of that is because we're uncomfortable because we're cramping or we feel damp. We don't feel clean. So what I'm offering when I go around to my, I tell everybody, I'm offering pain-free periods. Cramping is, 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 is optional. And when I say that in that manner, what I'm telling them is you now have a healthier alternative. So moving forward and leveling up i want to just be able to share the information with as many women as possible once i share the information my job is not done i stay connected if you want you have questions you want to ask me i'm available um it's 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 just a thing where making a significant change if it's like my friend told me she said you know tell them you're making a change one pad at a time that's good okay so I actually have another question. So what is one this is a thing that you think that women can do to make a significant impact in this decade? One thing one that women can do to make a, a significant impact. Call Selena. Partner with each other. Connect. Partner, connect. Partner, connect. Share, share, share. Share your information. Share the information of your sisters. Awesome. That's going to make it work. Well, thank you so much. It's been a pleasure having you on uh, to thank talk about me. the significance uh, of this decade for women in business. Please let the audience know where they can find you, right? Where they can connect yes. with you. You can find me on Facebook as Michelle Renee Alexander Druid. I also have a business page, Inspired Network. There are a couple of Inspired Networks, but you will see my face. I am on Twitter. I'm not on Twitter that much, but I'm on there enough at M Druid. I'm on Instagram as Harlem Diva 22 and I'm on LinkedIn. I'm on, you know, you'll see my face. So, um, I encourage women to have a conversation with me. Let's talk. I mean, about whatever you want to talk about, because 
I have a very vast network and I'm always willing to sh talk and partner, uh, uh, collaborate and share information because I think that that is the turning point for us. And I think that's why um, this year is so significant and the years that come, why they're going to be so significant as long as we, you know, we hang in there together. Absolutely. Well, again, thank you so much. Okay, ladies, thank you so much for tuning in to this special uh, broadcast, this special series, The Significance of This Decade for Women in Business. This decade is so important. So we hope you all have been inspired and empowered, and this encourages you to really Get out, come from behind the shadows, right? Amplify your voices. You have something that the world needs, right? And we want to hear about it. So if you would like to be a guest on our show, right, we would love to have you. Please visit us at www.shebosstalk.com. And thank you, thank you, thank you so much. You can always come visit us here on Facebook, on Facebook Live, and visit our show page where you can see more videos, more content to help you stay inspired and empowered. Thank you so much. Until next time. Thank you. Good night.